everybody, I'm your man, Dennis Pitzenberger, right here at SEMA Show from Power Auto Media, and I'm in the Edelbrock booth with my man, August, from Edelbrock. Now, you guys have had a tremendous amount of success with your Pro Flow fuel injection, and now you're bringing some to the guys that want to put boost on their LS3. Let's talk about this brand new manifold. Not a problem. We brought our Pro Flow 3 system to our Pro Flow XT manifold line for the rectangular port LS3 cylinder heads for the Chevrolet guys there. Now, what's that going to mean to the guys out there that want to put a bunch of boost on their motor and still run your guys' stuff on their race car? Well, the whole thing with the boosted idea is, you know, more and more pressure you put to it, your plastic manifolds, things like that, over time, weaken and explode. We're doing the high cast, you know, our cast aluminum manifolds, the 808 self-aging aluminum, in the same ISO 9001 range we do everything at Edelbrock. You know, and this manifold will take 90 to 105 millimeter throttle bodies. It's got six and a quarter inch runners on it. You know, put the pressure to it. They'll take it. What kind of RPM range is this set up for for the guys? Now, they're, they're running rectangle ports. They're not running old cathedral ports. What are they going to find in this manifold? Easily 7,500 RPM. What are the true advantages of this manifold versus something like you said, that plastic manifold? Let's go through some of the real reasons that people are going to want this on their race car. First and foremost, I'd say, one, it's made by Edelbrock. We're going to start our 80th year in 2018. It's made in the USA, cast in our own foundry, designed in-house, cast in-house, machined in-house, and shipped in-house, all made in the United States of America. All right, August, I know where to find the stuff. If people want more information about this LS3 XT ProFlow 3 Manifold, there's one place to go. Where is it? Edelbrock.com. You heard the man, Power Auto Media. We'll be back right here from the SEMA Show in the next video.